Hey, what is up guys? It is Justin here back bringing you the trade day results uh, for the three or four hour trade day that we had. Uh, we got six players up, 82 trade offers. It's only been a couple hours, but you guys absolutely smashed the trades, I guess. So we got a lot of trades to go through. Uh, a lot of good ones. I already checked a few of them, but I uh, haven't checked the main ones for this one. At least trade offers just keep coming in. So we're going to see what we get here. So first off, Logan Couture. Uh, you know what? I'll check Jay Bowmeister first. 10 trade offers. Uh, Kyle Turris, Dustin Penner, no thank you for that. Uh, we also got Marty Hanzo, Change Team Vancouver, uh, no thanks for that. I'm looking for at least 5k plus. Clapperton, ew, get that out of here. Get that out of here. Mark Stahl, Smith, uh, Williams, and Gagne, no thanks for that. Uh, 4k, Plakanitz, and Ennis, not too bad. Uh, Myers in 2k, it's definitely better than the first one. And I'm going to be a little bit stricter on the offer just because I need those pucks for Hot Roulette, right? I can't really be uh, losing a lot of money. And uh, sorry about the background noise. Uh, my friends are watching a scary movie upstairs and I decided to opt out because I do have a test coming up uh, soon as well. Uh, but Myers, JVR, and two Johnsons. Get that shit out of here. I mean, it's not a bad trade offer, but the Johnson coaches, no thanks. Uh, we got Rattel. If I was going to choose Rattel or the Myers in 2K, I would definitely take uh, the Myers deal. And then we got 8K in a Capitals jersey. I will take the 8K uh, just because the Myers deal doesn't really interest me too much because I'm just going to be selling Myers. I'm not going to be using him. So there you go. I'm going to take the 8K for Jay Bowmeister. Not too bad of a deal. So enjoy, enjoy your Jay Bowmeister. We're back up to 10K. And all of the money I make from these uh, trades, I'm going to use it back in Hot Roulette, which I was make, needed money for because uh, I was short on cash. But now we're okay after we sell these players. Uh, but next up, I think the cheapest guy is Tyson Berry on the Colorado Avalanche. Let's see what we have here. 8,000. Steve Mason, Luke Shen, Steve Downey. Uh, we got two pucks and a gold contract. How how generous. How generous. Uh, we got zero pucks. Uh, Boyle like Helm. I don't think Boyle likes Helm. Uh, we're going to reject that one. Uh, 3.5k Cassian and Lack, two uh, Vancouverians. Uh, no thanks for that. Uh, Reinhardt, Smallman, Johnson, and Tamperina, Elvis. Uh, no thanks for that. I'm not interested in bronze players at all at the moment. I've been doing all the collections. Uh, but uh, we got 8k that one. And we also got 3k and uh, Eric Stahl, I mean. I think Eric Stahl's a 10k player, so I do like that offer. Uh, Tyson Berry in 7. No, no thanks for that. I mean, I'm, I, get, I see what he's doing there. He wants to give me a Tyson Berry back with a 7,000. Kind of the quick sell value of Tyson Berry, but not too interested. Franz Nielsen, uh, Tyson Berry, a plus 5 ball and 141 coins. I like that deal. Not too bad. Uh, then we go here to 1.6k Keith Yandel, Nugent Hopkins, all right. And we also got one more deal, 10k, 10K go Coburn, and Halak. I don't know why I'm slurring my words here. Uh, so we got four trade offers. I can reject this deal for sure, the first one. Eric Stoll, I'm really liking. I mean, an 89 overall player. That is solid. Franz Nielsen is not worth too much. Uh, from what I know, I think he's like a 10, 15 K player, uh, with a plus five ball that does interest me. Cause I know plus five balls go for at least three K with Franz Nielsen. Ooh, I don't know. I think I might take a shot at the Franz Nielsen deal just cause there is a HFC card. But then again, Eric Stahl, I can sell right away. You know what? I'm going to take this deal. I'm going to avoid the HFCs just because they might be tough to sell. Uh, I don't know how many Tyson berries are in the market, so I'm going to keep it safe. For that deal you guys can let me know if that i should have taken the other deal or not but uh let's see what's the cheapest up next that would probably be anze kopitar with 13 trade offers he's like a 60 70k player he's not too expensive but he's not too cheap either right uh we got jeff carter tj oshi Semin, and howard uh carter is around 20 30 from what i know oshi is around uh 10 to 12k Semin, eh it's not too bad of an offer uh, Couture is like 12 to 15k as well. So you're getting a good 60k, which is not too bad. I like it. Uh, 40k Lad, Mason, Niemi, Gibson, no, no thanks for that. Uh, let's see what else we got here. 11.5k, Ryan Kessler, Victor Hedman, a 15 game duration and a plus 5 all. So Ryan Kessler goes for around 35k. So with the pucks, you're getting about 46. With Victor Hedman, I think he's still a 25k player. So that's around, what, 71k? With the 15 game duration, I like that deal more than the other ones for sure. Uh, I'm going to reject the Logan Couture deal just because I like that one better. The Carter, Oshi, Semin, and Howard deal, I'm going to reject as well. I think this deal is worth a bit more. Then we got Skinner and Gabby. 
Uh, Gabby is still around like 7 to 8k. Uh, 46, yeah, I'm going to reject that deal. Uh, this deal, I think, still the leading one. So many offers. Filpula, Ekman, Larson, Alsner, Tourist, no thanks. Uh, what else do we have here? 500 pucks, Bodker, Marshawn, no. No, I can't take that. JVR, Voracek, Giordano, and Mason, no. Cannot take that. I really need to make some coins back for sure. I, or at least an even deal. That's what I'm trying to go for. If it's not an even deal, or I'm losing too much, uh, then I'm not going to take it because I might as well just sell on the market, right? But then we got Krejci, Latang, 6k. I can reject that deal. Krejci is not worth too much uh, nowadays. 25k, Sharp, and Backstrom. Um, yeah, so Sharp is around 20k. So you're getting about 45k. Backstrom, uh, he is like a... I, I want to say 15k player. So you're getting about 60k with that. So that's not too bad. Uh, Ryan Kessler and 22k. Uh, when I compare it with this offer, I like this Kessler deal better than this 22k and Kessler deal. I can reject that one. We got three more, or two more to check. I can reject the Filpula. And what is this deal? 2.4k, Kyle Turris and Ryan O'Reilly. So, this is the deal I'm going to take. Thank you very much. Enjoy your Anse Kopitar. And I'll take those two players and a couple consumables. And that really does speed up the trade. So, we got three more guys here. And that should add up to how many trades left. 51? It actually is not too much to go through, alright? So, next one is probably Jamie Ben. Logan Couture is actually a pretty expensive player. Uh, so we'll see if we get any more better trades for him. But uh, Jamie Benn, he's worth around 65 to 70k. So let's see what we have here. Ryan Miller, Ham Hughes, Sedin, and Lupo. A lot of uh, Vancouverans, uh, once again. Uh, I'm going to right trigger that one. 5k, Marlowe, Backstrom, Landeskog. Marlowe's like a 25k player. 20 to 25. Backstrom, once again, 15k. I'm going to reject that deal. I like the first one a little bit better. And then we got Yasin. Oof. I don't know about that deal. That might just interest me. I might just check him later. Uh, Bobrovsky, Eberly, Johnson, Hartnell. I can reject that. Looking for at least 50k plus for Jamie Ben, right? I'm thinking Yasin's still worth a little bit because if you guys don't know, he's a six foot or not six foot. What am I saying? Four foot eight, 120 pounds, and people just love him for some reason. Richards, Shattenkirk. No thanks for that deal. I'm actually interested in Yasin. I'm actually thinking about it. Uh, Johansson, Helm, Hansel. Uh, no thanks for that. Those are all like quick sell players to me. Uh, Burnside, no. I actually need him for the Mississauga S Steelheads uh, collection. I think. I'm not sure. Uh, left wing center. Uh, what else do we got here? 40k, Howard, Ocposo, Markstall, and Molson, the Florida pack uh, here. But Howard's not worth too much. I think he's like 7, 8k with Ocposo. He's like 2k. Markstall, Molson. Eh, I'm not too interested in this deal. I'm going to reject that. Honestly, I would go for the first one just because it has a solid amount of pucks, right? 50k and Johansson. I'm going to guess Johansson's still like 4 to 5k, right? At least. 50k straight up, I would rather take... Oh, you know what? Uh, that's actually... Okay, they're both 50k, so I can reject that deal. Like, they're so close to each other, they look almost the same. Uh, it looks like it's 10k less, I mean. Steve Mason, Jonas Hiller, Burgess. No thanks for that. Let's see what else we have here. Koivu, Everly, Calgary, Flames. No thanks. Uh, we got 50 pucks and Matt Molson. No thanks. And I think we got 11k. Okay, 11k Carlson. So Carlson's around 50 uh, with 11k. I think Carlson's around like 48, 49 now. So that's like 60k, which is not too bad. Uh, Richard, Stastny, Bieksa, Cogliano. No thanks for that. 11k, 1.4k. Krejci, Martin St. Louis, Gabrick, and Richards. Uh, no, they're all like 7 to 8k players. I mean, Martin St. Louis is not too expensive nowadays. Like, they all add up to around like 40, 50k. But I'm looking for a bit more. Right? So, Joe Thornton, Daniel Sedin, Neil, and Gabby. Uh, no thanks for that deal. I'm not going to take that. And we got one more at the back here. Let's see what that is. 50 pucks and Parise. Parise right now is around 55k. So, I'm going to reject that. So, give me one sec, guys. I'm going to check the price of Yasin. I'll be right back once I find his value. Alright, so we're back at the Jamie Ben deal, and I took a look at Yasin's value, and the funny thing is, he is worth a shit ton. It's actually pretty hilarious. I'm going to reject this deal. Uh, Eric Carlson, yeah, that's like another 50000 Uh Not really too interested in that deal. This deal's not too bad, because you do get Daniel Sedin, who's worth like 10 to 15 k uh, With Ryan Miller, you're getting a good solid deal, but if you actually look at Yasin's value... Uh, Yasin's value is actually insane. It's going for around 100k right now. <laughs> Basically the starting price of Jamie Benn. So you know what? 
I am going to try out Yasin for a game maybe uh, and put him on the team. So there you go. Enjoy your Jamie Ben for a Ryo Yasin or real Yasin, whatever you want to call him. Enjoy your Jamie Ben. I accept an 82 overall. And uh, I want to show you the value of Yasin actually because I actually went through. Oh, oops. I actually went to um, went to the buy now section and all I could see for Yasin was all above 100k, which is crazy. So if I went to Playmaker. Uh, to free agents, sorry, NHL free agents, you'll see that he's going for like crazy amounts once I search this up. Uh, but let's see here. Uh, where is he? Yasin, 99k start price. Uh, then we got 124k buy now and 61k start price, but that's not for another 21 hours. So that is definitely the, I think that's the right trade to take. I mean, he's worth like 80, 90k and might as well take him. You know what? I think he was a uh, Make a Wish Foundation person, so you know what? I'll take him for the for the sake of the video, I guess, just to speed it up. Uh, but Logan Couture is the next one up. Phil Kessel will be the last one. Uh, Santorelli, Setter, uh, and Ranta. Uh, no thanks for that. Uh, we got 60k and Max Pacioretty, which we already talked about. Then we got Pacioretty, Rupert, Bork, and Tun. No thanks for that. Not too interested. And we got 1.5k, Hajalmerson. He got a nasty cut under his eye when he played against the Leafs. Pretty nasty. Uh, Eric Carlson and 14k, Subban and Hartman. So Eric Carlson, once again, he's around 50k now. He's gone really cheap on the Xbox One markets. So you're getting about 64k. Uh, sorry about that. Just 8. Uh, but I'm not too interested in that deal. Uh, 4 Joel Wards, no thanks for that. Uh, we also got 50k in Gergensons. Gergi. Uh... So if I'm gonna take any of these offers, I'm actually don't want to take any of these offers because uh, I know Couture goes for like 75k plus, and with Pacioretty 60k, ugh, I might I might delay it. All right, I'm gonna reject this deal straight up, uh, and then maybe take the Max Pacioretty deal in the 60k. So I'll delay it. We'll see what happens. So last but not least, fill the thrill Kessel. Let's see how much uh, how many trades we got here. So plus five all. No, are these all troll trades? Oh shit! Here it comes. Here it comes. All right. Anze Kopitar, Bufflin, and Evander Kane. No, we can reject that. I already know Anze Kopitar's value is not too much uh, nowadays. So, duration three, no thanks. Carter, Nugent, Hopkins, and Missian, uh, no thanks. Reject. 35k in Hosa. I know someone on Twitter want to do this deal with me, so I might just take that. That's a very, very uh, solid deal. I mean, straight up, not in, like Hosa is like a 60, 70k player at least, right? And with the pucks, I, I, like you can't beat that. But Krejci Sagan, Sagan's like 40 to 50k right now. Uh, with the puck 70, you're getting about 80 to 90k. I can reject that. The first deal is obviously better. Yakov Voracek, I'm not sure how much he goes for. I'll have to del delay that. Patretti, Camilleri, Shane Doan, and Aginla. Uh, they all have like these purple backgrounds. They all look like the same team. Uh, but no thanks, I'm going to reject that deal. Not too interested. So Yakov Voracek might actually go for a little bit. I'm not sure. Uh, Claude Giroux, ooh. 99 boosted. Uh, I will delay that. 58k Miku Koivu and Helm. Uh, no thanks for that. 2k Latang Tarasenko. Uh, we got the fourth deal here. Uh, Marion Hosen 250. We already got the 35k pucks with that one. So I'm not going to take that one. Patrick Gabrick, Evander Kane, Vanek. I can reject that. Uh, definitely the first three or four offers are really, really good. Can't beat those. Uh, lots of troll trades now. Uh, Valdor. Uh, we got plus three high. Oh god. Um, we got the Schwin Schwinger Wings. I don't know what that was. Wild Wings. <laughs> Plus two all. Uh, what else do we got here? 50 Pucks and Harluk. Uh, and then we got another... <laughs> oh, just Troll Trades. Fuck off. Uh, bronze Contract 50. And we got another one. And... <laughs> uh, okay, we got another legit trade here. I was just about to reject that. Tuka Rask, Vlasic, and Patcher Eddie. I'm not sure how much Rask goes for. I have to delay it. Uh, Wingles, Couturier, McDonough, Lucic, I can reject that uh, straight up. We got another offer here. Sharp, Carter, two Backstroms. I don't want two Backstroms. No thanks for that. Uh, I'd rather take the Hosa and 35k straight up. But I really want to check the price of Warcheck and Tuka Rask. I can reject the Bacchus and Howard deal straight up. And let's see what is at the back here. What was at the back? 92k? We got 92,000 there. Alright, I'll keep that in the delay section. So I'm going to check the values of Warcheck and... Um, Mr. Tuka Ras. Let me just check it right now. Might as well. I'll let you guys see it as well. Instead of just delaying it. But, uh, bye. Go here. Go goalies. And, goalies. 
goalies on Boston, right? I think Tuka Rask still goes for quite a bit, right? But I'm not exactly sure. Definitely goalies are not worth too much this year, but we'll have to see. 81k for Rask, all right. 80k, 81, 84, 82, yep. Yeah. So you're getting about 80k for Tuka Rask. Then we gotta check Mr. Uh, Voracek here. Right wing on the Philadelphia Flyers, right? So let's go all the way here to the Philadelphia Flyers and see how much he's worth. I think he... Oh, no, it froze. Ah, oh, God damn it. I'll be right back, guys. All right, we are back. We finally got the screen loading. Uh, it took long enough, but let's go see the value of Yakov Voracek. I have to restart everything. I don't know why it does that randomly, but let's go to the Philadelphia Flyers uh, and right wing NHL Philadelphia and see how much he's worth. 90k. 50, 50k? Oh, shit. I thought he was going to be at least 90 plus. Uh, but 48k could actually be a pretty good pickup if you want to get a good player. Uh, isn't he like 87 overall? I think so. So he might be a really good player to have. But uh, I talked to a guy on Twitter and he said that he did not want to give me that hosted deal. He didn't want me to uh, accept it. So I won't take it for sure, all right? Uh, but I'll reject the Carter Marl... Uh, Backstrom, we got a lot of 89s here, but I'm not interested in a 4 for 1 for Kessel. That just, a oh, bitch to sell. Uh, Bergeron, 2.2k. Someone wanted me to reject the host of deals, so I'll reject that. 4 check will, will reject. Uh, Koivu back is Varlamov. Yandel, no thank you for that. 7.4k. Uh, then we got um, Rask, Vlasic, and Pacioretty. So we know Rask is 80. Uh, Pacioretty is around 5 to 6k. It's not worth too much nowadays. And Vlasic. Then we got the 92k straight up. I do like the Claude. Sorry about that. My uh, recording just cut out. I don't know why, but I started up the recording back again. And uh, we still have four trade offers to go through. But uh, we got Carter Sharp and Marlow. Uh, not too interested in. Uh, I did check this deal out. Claude Giroux are around 87 to 88k. With the Pucks, you're getting about 94 to 95k with that deal, which is not too bad. However, I am still interested in keeping uh, Phil Kessel just because there's not too many in the market as well. And Claude Giroux is just hard to sell, especially on the right wing. I'm going to reject that. I might just keep Phil Kessel for sure. Uh, but Rask, Vlasic, Pacioretty, not too interested in. The 92k, like I said, it's a good amount of pucks, but I'm not interested in losing money because I did actually pay coins to buy the Phil Kessel. I'm not too interested in losing him for that price. If he can up it to like 100k, I might just take it, but... Other than that, I'm not too interested in 92k. Same with this deal. Max Pacioretty in 60k. Uh, I paid a little bit of coins for Couture, so I'm not too interested in uh, getting rid of Couture at that price, unfortunately. So I'm going to reject that deal. So we got two players left, uh, but that is basically the end of the trade day. I'm not going to take an offer for everything, but if there's a really good offer coming in for Kessel and Couture later, I might just throw that into the video later. <laughs> but anyways, that is just about it. Uh, I will fast forward the clip. If not, this will be the end of the video. Uh, I'll throw it into the end, but we'll see. All right. Anyways, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoy. I'll see you guys later. Bye. Most you can do is just pass it off and go right into the next game. But anyways, let's do the 26th player here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two.